From the Carly B. TV newsroom, I'm Dr. Carlisha Booz. The Supreme Court said it will no longer stand in the way of a long-blocked Biden administration policy to prioritize the deportation of immigrants who are deemed to pose the greatest public safety risk or were picked up at the border. The justice rejected a challenge from some Republican-led states to policy that. The administration says there is not enough money or manpower to deport all 11 million or so people who are in the U.S. illegally. The director of the GBI is stepping down after less than a year on the job. GBI director Mike Register said he's accepted an offer to serve as a public safety director for Cobb County in Metro Atlanta. County commissioners schedule a Tuesday vote to formally hire him. Kemp's office said Register will remain as GBI director through July. There was no immediate announcement of who would replace him. The Food and Drug Administration said it has sent warning letters to dozens of retailers selling fruit and candy-flavored disposable e-cigarettes, including the current best-selling brand Elf Bar. The FDA and CDC also cited Elf Bar in a separate report about thousands of calls to U.S. poison centers concerning e-cigarettes, mainly involving children under age 5. When accidentally ingested, liquid nicotine can cause seizures, convulsions, vomiting, and brain injury. For more news on the go, visit at CarlyBTV.com.